Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to teach you how to create your Shopify store step by step from the beginning to the end. And I'm gonna show you some specific steps you would like to know or you have to know in order to have your store completely built and make sales over it. So now, as you can see here, uh, I'm gonna bring you to the, to the store by following these steps as a beginner. So this roadmap will launch the revenue ready to Shopify. We will discover choosing niche, securing domain, selecting high converting team, creating collection, optimized product page, set up, setting up payment shipping, installing must have an app, and launching SEO, email, social ads, everything you need to go from zero to sell fast within Shopify. So now, I hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to teach you how to create your Shopify store step by step from the beginning to the end. And I'm gonna show you some specific steps you would like to know or you have to know in order to have. Okay, let's continue. Now we are home. Home, that's where you find everything show up. Let's say this is home right here. You can see order, product, customers, marketing, discount. Content marketing, finance analysis, point of sale. And these are some videos that I uploaded. They wasn't there. And if you do it in your own, if, as a fresh one, you're not going to see all these, but some of them, yes. And to begin, you're going to click home, as you can see right there. And the next one, you're going to click. First, before you do everything, you have to go to setting. When you come to setting, you're gonna buy your domain. You can see my domain here, but you got to buy your domain. Like the first thing you do, you click on domain, and you're gonna buy new domain. If you had a domain somewhere else, you can transfer it. You can come here, you say existing domain and transfer domain. So if you had a domain, if you do not have a domain, you can say new domain. Okay, so now let's click on new domain. And it's gonna show you one page over here. And you can see available and everything down there. That's all the domain you can buy with different price. Different prices show up. You can always do that here. And after you buy in your domain, it's gonna show up to your store after you pay everything. If you say click buy, you're gonna show up where you have to put your you're going to tell you to pay, put your card number and everything, and you're going to say buy after you finish over here. So I don't have to do so because I already have mine. So what I would do here, just go back. Okay, go back. Okay, after I finish, it's going to show up 24 to 48 hours. And after I finish my domain, so now I can go ahead and upload my team. Okay. Over here, I already have my domain. I already, I put my address right here, billing address. I put my address here. And you can put country where you located at. And down here. You're gonna put notify customers to the shipment when they order in the way. You're gonna click on the first one. And after an order has been fulfilled and paid, or when all items have been refunded, automatically achieve the order. The order will be removed from the list of unopened order. Okay. You can always get down here and read more information. Okay, now let's go on the plan. When you get to plan, that's where you're going to change your plan or take a plan. So now, you get $80, $30, $39, $105, and you can always choose one of these. Just select and then pay. Select it and then go pay it. 
after that let's go to the next step so you now you can set up for payment and you're gonna put your own bank information where Shopify has to pay you and you're gonna pay them it's a payment accepting payment receiving payment both of them in the same place right here accepting payment and receiving payment so you're gonna click on manage here and it's gonna show you where you have to put your account set up and down here you can manually put it or you can automatically put it manage payment man i mean payment method customization manage payment okay so after you finish the payment parts you can come back down here and you can click on policies you got to read the policies customer privacy you can read them customer privacy nobody can see the customer information and then customer policies when it's come to the policies you can read them but if you bring your own brain remember you can always edit the policies let's see i want to edit this one here i click on it and it's open this window to me and where i can edit it i can put something else to it if i want to it depend what i want to change it for and it's gonna be changed and this you can always put your email in to make sure your email you get receive an email where something going on when something is going on when something goes wrong they're gonna email you automatic okay you can click on each one of them to get the information changed if you want to edit them so after that i will see on the policy you done you finished and let's go back to home page you choose your plan you make up your payment you oh actually the ship the shipments and delivery that's another way but they always remain the same if you do not change anything from the policies they're gonna remain the same so now let's go back to setting i mean to the home page where you're gonna put your product you're gonna download some app over your business let's go back okay let's continue to show you let's continue right here okay so we back to home page so now we're gonna click on product right here when product open as you can see i already have a multi product that added to here in order to add it, these product you have to just click on collection and that's where you find all the windows which is your accessory different pages like jewelries watches watch or you can see wings earrings necklace thing like that if you have different products you can always name them up from here and the collection and remember you have to create your menus in order to put your menus in i'm gonna show you where you have to click in order to bring your menu in book transferred these are there's nothing in them customers there's some email somebody already went in and okay so let's go home here and let's say content discount analytic
If you're gonna add product, you're gonna say add product here. And you add your product name, you put your descriptions and upload that product. And it's good to go. And after you finish, you say save. If you do not, you say discard. So after you finish, you go to apps. And you can download any apps you want over here. You install it, you fill it out, and it's done. And if you do not know which app to use, you can come here to all recommended app. You open this window and you come here to all recommended app. And it's going to open this window to you and you're going to read all recommended app they have. And you're going to see which one is fit you, which is uh, fit your business. And you use, you use it. As you can see, you can go Shopify app stores right here. And it's open to you the window here where you can find all of them inside out. You can take your time to read them and choose what you need from them. Which one fits your business, which, which one you would like to be on your inside your Shopify to manage it as a robot. Remember, we've been talking about robots since a um, couple of years from now and how you automate your business with our robots, but I know I leave that page, it take me to the other side, but no worry, we're still here. Um, when you click here, it's gonna take you to the next page, but this is not, not what you want, you can always uh, go back to the next page. And guys, that's all I have for you, uh, see you next time.